What the hell? It says I'm offline. But I'm playing. Let's refresh it. the fuck is going on here? Okay, so let's go. Bandits sank our whole caravan, you know, and well, uh, who are you? Why do you have a sharky boat? So, you must be a newbie with amnesia. <laughs> Y'all always appear from nowhere. Uh, uh, amnesia isn't contagious, right? Oh, uh, <laughs> I got carried away. Let's get acquainted. My name is Kitty Sark. After the bottle, when I was born. A bottle with a real cork and a note got washed up against our pontoon. The elders took the cork. The note was sold to the scavengers. And I got my name from the label. You won't regret it. I promise. <laughs> I'm a great shooter. That's what everyone says. Besides, I know that sharkies have a treasure map. Let's get it. Uh, you don't have a machine gun on your boat? That's not right. The place is swarming with sharky gangs. We need a machine gun ASAP. Just pick up the machine gun. It's there in the wreckage. It's gonna be a bit too hard without one. Hooray, now we have a machine gun. Hurry, open the constructor, select the machine gun, and mount it on the deck. Uh, okay, so how do we do this? Yeah. I know that Sharkies have a treasure map. Let's get it. There they are. They must still have the map. Sink them, Captain. Captain, hold the boost for sharp turn. Just keep an eye on the battery's charge. to decrypt it and we'll go look for the treasure all we have to do is get a decent boat and assemble a crew the mantis bar is nearby it's a frequent haunt for unemployed sailors maybe we'll manage to hire someone Well, this is going to be a good fucking co-op game. I see a mine. Careful, Captain. In these waters, you could easily run into an ancient mine and end up swimming with the fishes. Oh shit, there's a power boost for the boat. Fuck me. Hey, gorgeous, I'm Mantissa. I run the Mantis Bar. They call me female Mantis by my back, but don't be afraid yet. You here on business or to relax, handsome? 
Well, that depends. He... <laughs> ah, so you're looking for me or company? That's pretty quiet here today. There's one sailor who was interested in work. Talk to him. <laughs> to talk to a different person, press their portrait on the right. <laughs> to talk to a different person, press their portrait on the right. No, I wanna... <laughs> to talk to a different person, press their portrait on the right. Greetings to the free captain. My name is Jack. I'm an experienced sailor. I'm looking to work as a boatswain on a decent vessel. But I can be a sailor or a carpenter. And I'm quite a good shot too. <laughs> a jack of all trades, so to speak. Uh, but the three of us on your rubber boat? Although, I know where to get a decent boat, if you're not afraid to take risks. There's a ridge of rocks nearby. It's like Meg's. Meg has decided to hide there. The eggheads are gone, but the boat has to be attacked. Don't care, fix my boat, hurry up. Captain, there's loot in the cargo hold. I can sort it. Resources for repairing and making things always come in handy. No forward. Press space bar. I like the we'll way soon. Hurry. Enter emergency mode. Press space bar. Okay, I shouldn't have taken those cunts on. That was a bit, um, that was a bit full on. We need to go back and get the treasure chest that we lost, Captain. I already know it's like, the on the map. It's like Waterworld sort of thing. So, you get a boat, you get to upgrade your boat, and all sorts of, like, get bigger boats and everything else, and you just go around collecting shit, I think. Not sure exactly, but you know, we'll figure it out. We we'll always do. Take all. Oh, 
Hey, back off you little bastards. I turned around and shoot the fuckers, but I haven't figured out how to drive forward and shoot backwards at the same time. Ow, piss off, bitches. Tell that to the two rankers chasing us. Oh shit, now we're cornered. Something's still chasing me. Oh shit, they are still chasing me. Oh shit. Back off you little bastards. I'll give you a barge that's almost new without asking too many questions. <laughs> Shall we? Yeah. Now we have a pump. When the hull is breached, I'll pump the water out. Captain, the hull is damaged. We've got nothing to repair with it.
now, but I've got a boat with a crane. I've got a boat with a crane on the back to pick stuff up off the seabed. Hey, Jimmy, meet my new captain. Hello, Captain. And hello to you too, Kitty. Glad you're doing well. Yo, Doc! Yes. It's co-op up to five players. Hang on. I'll do the... I'm trying to get him to get it. Um, options. Share my audio. I just come back from my two week holiday over in Japan and I'm knackered. My name is Jimmy Bean. How can I help you? I can see that. Not a problem. If you won't throw Kitty overboard for her blabbing, call it square. But if we are being serious, there is one problematic pirate. Yeah, but it won't be easy. His trimmerin is armed to the teeth. By the way, Kitty, I heard that the treasure you're chasing was already taken care of by that bastard. I had an awesome time. Went to Japan. Got back about... two or three days ago. And I'm still trying to recover. Not so fast. The new barge could use a second machine gun. There's a diver village not far from here, and they trade in restored weapons. We just need to choose the holes lining, mount the steering wheel and other modules, check the energy consumption, and it's ready to be set afloat. Um, choose the material of the holes lining. Plastic wood I can't do metal because I don't have enough so we'll do wood Doesn't look like it needs repairing anywhere else. We'll stay from the rear of the boat, thanks. We just need to choose the holes lining, mount the steering wheel and other modules, check the energy consumption, and it's ready to be set afloat. It's energy consumption, minus two, plus four. Uh, hull strength is gonna maximum speed goes down by 0 0.1 power is 4500 have 250 in reserve yep okay we just need to choose the holes lining set new yes, vessel after the repairs the boat just feels different eager to fight yeah and So, they're recycled. Well, I don't know whether I like this. I'd prefer the... Captain, what's that on the left of us? Hi, surfacers. Oh, 
It's nice to breathe in some surface fresh dwellers. air. You won't believe. Looks like I've surfaced just Freaking cheap over there, though, Look, Doc. The canary has kicked the bucket. Poor bird. Well, I haven't been sailing it around in the air. I look for all kinds of goodies on the bottom and sell them to dealers. Family business and all that. My dad and brother work in shallow waters, and I'm a serious depth specialist. Hmm. Not really. It's dark, stuffy, and you can suffocate there. It's easier to live on the surface after all. Although I see it's not easy for you here. You're sailing around in a barge with only two sailors and a machine gun. Are you looking for a sailor? Today is your lucky day. My little brother has been dreaming about joining a ship crew for quite a while. He's thoroughly sick of tinkering with machinery in shallow waters and is afraid of the submersible. He's claustrophobic. He isn't hard to find. Sail to the Iron Tower that used to produce electricity in ancient times. Our family business is set up on it. You'll find my brother there. Wait. In the depths, I saw that the witch's boil is heading that way. Be careful or you might lose your vessel. How pleasant it is to breathe some fresh air. Oh, the witch's boil. Well, when you see steam all around and the water turns white, stop the boat at once. Otherwise, we'll lose the hull's lining. Well, they say it's the spirit of the depths boiling ink out of a giant scuttlefish. Well, maybe it's nonsense, but it's... Hey, piss off! Sold everything to a wholesaler. We'll have new guns next week. You must be our free captain. Some people have all the luck. Sailing around the world, meeting Meet people, new people, shooting, robbing, yeah, living, it's pretty cheap. Most of our life. meals cost us anywhere between here, ten to fifteen dollars, and they were like having a three-course meal. Day in, day out. Your crew? Seriously? I would right now, but Dad won't let me. He cares more about the family business than excitement. I'm going to rot here. That's impossible. But if it works, I'll jump on your boat in a heartbeat, Captain. What do you want, Drifter? We don't sell trash here. Try the scavengers. We only deal in bulk, no exceptions. Seriously? I'd be happy to let him. He's dreamt of adventures since he was a boy, and he can't stand the work here. I do, but our family has an unbreakable tradition. Any son who leaves the family must build a weapon to take with him with his own hands. You have only one machine gun? Let my son find a part to craft a good machine gun and install it onto your boat. Oh, oh, I'm so sick of this place. No way. You're joking, right? I'm all yours, Captain. Ready to serve you to the grave. I know where to find the wreckage of a military plane with a gun on it. Keep heading for the marker. Okay. That dredge here. Use the winch. Pick up the container when the dredge is done. Captain, the hull is damaged. We've got nothing to repair it with. Yeah, yeah, we'll work on that later. Right now we're collecting goodies for a. Um How do we go? Take all. Great. Now choose craft, then select the machine gun, 
Press the craft button and choose me in the crew list. So, what do we do? No, that's settings. How do we get to that? Ships menu. Oh, device menu. No. Consumables. Nope. Oh. There's no critical damage, Captain. Okay, so how do we get to what? Craft a machine gun, go there. Go to craft. Craft. Can we put a second gun on here without it interfering with everything? Captain, the machine gun's ready to be mounted on the deck. But first, remove the barrel and mount a generator. The machine gun needs powering. So what? Uh, okay. Large caliber machine gun mount the machine gun. Press that. Oh, constructor. Okay. weapons okay yeah constructor Warehouse. Aha. Where is the other gun? There. No. There. Okay, so... <coughs> <coughs> Two guns. Uh, warehouse. Let's put that on that side. Hey. What is this for? Metal barrel. Building pontoon superstructures. 
I need to pick a boat. We know. Now we can tear apart that pirate on the trimaran flying the black flag. The one Jimmy was talking about. You better be right, bitch. Captain, the hull is damaged, and we've got nothing to repair it with. Well, it'd be nice if you actually gave me, um... Oh, did you ban someone, Doc? <laughs> the pirate trimaran is ahead. Send it to the bottom. Shoot the engine and the barrel.
Captain, the hull is damaged. We've got nothing to repair it with. Don't lie. Search any of these rocks or not? I don't think so. Yes, they were cheating using rockets. Hopefully, without damaging the contents. I'm dying to know what's inside. Hooray, Captain! We did it. We are in the center of the sector. All we have to do now is get to the city in the north. All hands on deck, full speed ahead. Set course to the three whales. Hmm. Set course to the three whales. Oh, great. Well, hang on. Before we do that, we want menu, crew, she has a level up. Let's make it reload faster. Upgrade skill. Okay. I don't even know what I put on him for skill. Um, damage control or armor patching. Hmm. Let's go with this one. Uh, and then... Well, he's not a very good freaking shooter then, is he? Swift crafter, yes. 10% crafting speed. Oh, no. We'll go repair speed. Thanks. Thank you very much, Lee. Yes. Um, there. Okay, so that must be me. Oh, 20% engine power in boost I picked, unfortunately. Nice. This trove was worth the effort. So many cool. things. There's even a fishing rod. Yeah, so the re the little recycling thing is then recycling all the materials we found so far. Now there is Okay, yes, there is a map. Hey. Why is that not going across? Uh, do I have to get rid of this freaking thing first? Oh, they're still recycling. Captain, look, what's that thing flying over there? Let's get closer. Do you really see us, Drifter? But we are ghosts. No <laughs> one ever sees our balloon. Well, almost no one. My name is Flying... Flying what? And I'm Dutchman. Seriously? The chick's name's Flying, the guy's name's Dutchman. Go figure. Well, since you can actually see us, We'd like to be friends with you and help you somehow. 
head north to three whales. All newbies have to introduce themselves to the mayor. Do you need anything else? I want a, a powerful cannon. cannon. Yeah, newbies all love cannons. We'll look for something for you from above. When we find something, we'll let you know. We'll be seeing each other quite a bit now, Drifter. We are always glad to see you. Oh, it's so lonely up here sometimes. No one sees us ghosts. Lonely? What the hell is wrong with you? You've got a hot chick next to you. You're in a hot air balloon above everything. We are always glad to see you. Can we search some of these rocks? Hey, let me search a rock before. Oh, they're still recycling. Oh, actually. Do we have anything in the... Hey! Oh shit! That's not good. Wow, these things have got some fucking range. Piss off my debris. It's all mine, bind us keepers. Repair my boat. Settle down, dickheads! Don't blow up, don't blow up. Fuck me, that was close. Hey, where's all my other debris going? There.
birth is close, Captain. I'm Sergeant Hawkins, Deputy Sheriff. <laughs> you yeah, handled the Sharkies you. well. It was fun to watch. City of Three Wheels is open to you, Captain. Unless you get yourself blacklisted. You can visit the, the mayor, the sheriff, the post office, and the trade post. I'm the mayor of Three Wells. My name is Rudy J. Glad to greet a free captain. If you promise to participate in the defense of the sector from Sharkies and pirates, we'll give you a piece of the base to settle down in. Oh, cool. We get a base. Sweet. You'll need a translocator to get to the base quickly. There's a workshop a few miles to the north. They'll give you the device. To learn more about your prospects, talk to the bartender. His name is Ledeye. <laughs> You'll find the Whale's Tail Bar in the north of the city. Once again, your base is now in three whales. After a lecture at the bar, don't forget to pick up the translocator from the North Workshop. The Mayor of Three Wells is always at your service, Captain. I'm Sheriff Johnson. Three Wales Self-Defense Force. Welcome to our sector, Captain. Captain, I should warn you, coffee and tea are strictly prohibited in our sector. Possession what? and distribution are severely punished. Who bans coffee? If the rangers need help, I'll call you. Either to protect our caravans or to attack the enemy ones. I'm John Johnson, Sheriff. At your service, Captain. I'm a representative of the Three Whales Postal Service. You can always get a contract with us for mail delivery. Oh, really? Mail delivery? The Three Whales Postal Service is at your service. Yeah, how dare they ban my coffee? Peace to you, newbie. Kagawa trade posts are not involved in politics. We are open to everyone. My name is Fast Pickergate. Fast Pickergate? Really? To all. I wish you luck and good deals. Three Wheel City is open for you, Captain. Until you get into the black list. What the hell is this silly bitch doing at the... the mayor, sheriff, post station, and the trading post. Uh... Yeah, okay. I saw you talking to the mayor. Don't trust him. He's a coward and a bore. Cool guys should avoid people like him. Well, I saw you beat the Sharkies. Not too shabby. You sure have some Navy battle skills? I'm Helga. Helga Tearaway. But I can't chat right now. I'll be waiting for you at the bar. Try hiring sailors while you're there. Oh. Get a reward. What the fuck is that then? I want one of them. I definitely want one of them. Um... So where's the bar? I presume the bar must be around the other side then. Oh shit, I don't like that idea. I just want the bar people. I don't think I need to hire anybody else just yet, but I do need the bar. Hello, Captain. I can see it in your eyes. You're new here and haven't decided what you want to do yet. In our world, all paths are open for a newcomer. Pick the one that suits you. See for yourself. 
If you like risk and nighttime raids, befriend a courier gang and become a smuggler. Illegal tea and coffee are in high and stable demand. If law and order is your motto, join the ranks of the rangers and intercept smuggling vessels. You'll earn glory in the respects of honest citizens. If the word law makes you sick, then become a pirate and rob rich caravans. It's quick money, but also cost at risk. Headhunters will be on your tail at all times. If a black flag is not to your liking, make money on contracts to destroy pirate ships. Traders are ready to handsomely reward anyone who makes their routes any safer. The most meticulous and stubborn can become underwater explorers. Find deposits of valuable resources on the ocean floor before others and, well, get rich. This is the path of a true explorer. If you're good with numbers and capable of thinking a few moves ahead, you cannot venture out to sea at all. Play the stock market and buy and sell stuff others have extracted. Less romance, but more money. You yeah, know that's all right, Doc. Got to do what you got to do. I'm nursing a cold at the moment and a very sore body. <laughs> Well, anyway, you'll get your place where you can build your dream settlement. There you will build your new ships, experimenting and combining until you achieve the perfect combination of properties of your own super ship. Ooh. The most important thing, rumor has it that an ancient Chinese nuclear icebreaker sank in this sector. The biggest nuclear vessel of the ancient world, in fact. Interesting. Whoever manages to find and salvage their monster can found their own private sector in the ocean and be in total control. A hundred times cooler than any major. Sounds what tempting. else can I help you with? Yes, there was one in here looking for work. He ran off somewhere but should be back any minute. Our establishment is always at your service, Captain. What do you want, newbie? Are you talking to me? Have you lost your mind? Who the hell are you to hire me? And that's it? You think you can get away with just an apology? <laughs> I'll tear you limb from limb for insulting me like that. I'll have to teach you a lesson, you impudent newbie. Call me a friggin' newbie, bitch. My boat, the dead scuttlefish, is riding at anchor to the north of the bar. I'll wait for you there. Get your boat ready for a battle. Quite a hothead you are. You only just came and already got into a fight with the cuttlefish captain. Are you deathless or just fearless? Well, never mind. I have a lot to tell you. About the most important, of course. Everyone here is lying, especially to the newbies. I heard the bartender blabber on about pirates and headhunters. What a load of bull. You can trust me, though. <coughs> Quiet. It's dangerous to chat in here. Someone might be listening. Meet me in North Workshop after you deal with the cuttlefish captain. I'll introduce you to an important man. You'll learn how to get even cooler. And how to become a pirate. Maybe. Captain, do you see that visitor? This is the manager of your base. Meet him if you have time. Hey, Captain. Good day. I am Vix, the manager of your base. I'm gonna Fine. get the train I'll now. wait for you at the base. I'll tell you everything on the spot. Our establishment is always at your service, Captain. Okay, so, yeah, we're not dealing with you right now. Uh, I suppose I have to, don't I? Wait, hang on. Crew. Okay, this must be me. So, motor man, additional, um, 10 percent additional power, 10 percent reduced flooding during a breach. Um, hmm. 
I presume this is me. We'll go 10% reduction of flooding, thanks. Oh, they've all got upgrades. Um, let's go for increased damage. Oh, she's got another one. Oh yeah, let's definitely go for that. I don't think we need bonus Watsy just yet. Okay, so she's got no skill points left. Um, armor repair speed. We still got a point. Um, more durable pumps, distillers, etc. Work five percent. Yeah, we'll do this one. And then he's the shooter, apparently. Um, crafting speed. Chance to save 2% of resources during repairs. Let's do that one. And let's do saves 5% of resources when crafting. Yep, we'll do that one. We'll come back to the crafting speed thing later. Oh, I've gone up another level. Okay. Um, additional engine power, modular repair speed. Okay, so dealing with the captain is not on my priority list right now. Oh shit! Bump, bumpity bump. Oh shit! Fuck, lucky. Damn, that button's gotten touchy over the fucking days. This my base. City of Three Wheels is open to you, Captain. Unless you get yourself blacklisted, uh, you can visit the mayor, the sheriff, the post office. Hang on, is there? No, that's settings. Crew craft translator, oh, which we have to go get. Okay. Is this your vessel? Seriously? So, you've decided to teach the captain of the dead scuttlefish a lesson on this tub? Uh, I haven't laughed so hard in a long time. You do realize I can sink your tiny boat with a single volley? Or just crush it with the prow? My scuttlefish won't even notice it. Being told size doesn't I matter. Fight, kids. How about you build yourself a proper gunboat first, and then come find me and teach me a lesson, if you can, of course. <sighs> Two hundred thirty feet long, Captain. We'll be able to build an even larger ship, Captain. I see the flying bubble to the west. It's your new acquaintances. Shall we go see them? This is going to be a bit of a delicate balance between power and weaponry and everything else I need to put on this bitch. We've got <coughs> weapons for you, Drifter. 
Sharkies have just robbed a caravan next to those rocks to the north. If you hurry up, you'll be able to grab their loot. By the way, you better put some protection on your boat's hull. If you see barrels in the sea, pick them up. They'll come in handy. If we see a lot of barrels somewhere, we'll let you know. We are always glad to see you. Oh, it's so lonely up here sometimes. No one sees us ghosts. Visit us more often, will you? I presume these are the rocks she's talking about. Nice trophies. After you mount them on the deck, you can switch the weapon groups. Cap, the mayor said something about a translocator. Let's stop by the workshop and pick it up. It's nearby. Right, you bastards need to work faster. <coughs> Fuck me, levels again. Uh, let's go for this one. Let's go with this one, seeing so we don't have anything else to spend her points on right now. He's the bot swain. 12% more durable, yes, give me that. And he's the shooter. So, grenade launchers, cannons inflict, we'll, get, we'll go with the crafting speed. This time round. No, backwards, fuck ya. Yeah. 
Hi, Drifter. I'm Crankshaft, the best mechanic Ooh. in this sector. I can repair any tub. Good. Glad to meet you. Repair my tub. Hmm, you're a newbie, aren't you? And you came here for a translocator? You're lucky, buddy. Here's the last one. There's a lot of newcomers in the sector, so these gadgets are... Well, they're flying off the shelves. Ooh, 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 ooh. Are they just... Activate the device by selecting the translocator. You can use this to instantly move between settlements you've visited at least once. Three whales and my workshop are already in it. Oh, cool. Oh, it's like a fast travel thing. Take this receiver for communication. It'll be useful. Hey, where do I get Usually a bigger boat? Usually captains build their boats themselves on their own bases. But you are a newbie. Try to contact the Seven Feet Shipyard. Maybe you'll settle on a reasonable price. It's to the east, not very far from here. For starters, here's my advice. Make shields for your boat, or at least hang wheels on the top sides. Hey newbie, this is Tornado. He's a serious guy, unlike the mayor. Hey rookie. Helga told me you defeated Sharkies around three whales. If you're really cool, you and I are gonna be friends. Don't think about it, sailor. First you need a good ship and a decent crew. And a good ship can only be built or taken away from a weakling. Have you heard anything about PVP? It's in the volcano sector. You'll get the coordinates when the time comes. If you're deemed worthy, Billy Bonds will come for you himself. First, go buy a better boat. You'll get the shipbuilder's address from the mechanic. Then you can rely on fate. A good enemy will make you into a great captain. And be sure to level up your sailors. Don't be afraid. PvP needs brave, risky captains. I hope you're one of them. Shall we start collecting barrels? Kichiro will be able to make shields for the hull from them. We need lots of barrels for shields. We should ask the ghosts where we'll be able to find enough.
see a barrel. Shall we pick it up? See the balloon. Will you ask the ghosts about barrels? Hi. We know where you can find lots of barrels around the Ladle Archipelago. The rocks there look like ladles. It's where the first colonist bases used to be. You can always find old broken pontoons made of barrels there. One more thing. On your way, you'll see an old weather station. It's usually called Mermaid's Tower. You might want to check it out. It could come in handy. There's a convenient road right to it. A road, you know? A non-modal sea current, if that makes more sense to you. Anyway, this road will take you almost to Mermaid's Tower. blazing over there in the distance. must have sunk a courier. We should go up to it and check whether anything valuable is still there.
Captain, there's a fortune teller living in a tower nearby. Maybe we should visit her? What if she can help you get over your amnesia? Fortune teller here. Who are you? Admission is by the pearl only. Actually, I'm very busy, but I happen to have a free minute now. Anyway, you may come in. My name is Mermaid. I'm a 10th generation seer and fortune teller. This magic tower has been in my family since the old days, before the flood. Huh. You are either blind or rude. Get to the point. Judging by the look of you, you're new. Amnesia bothering you? Then what would you like to know about? I'll get you an answer from the astral plane. Your first question is free. Huh, <laughs> land? You want to waste your one free question on senseless drivel? Have you come from drifter how could you know there's land in the world <laughs> yes as it turns out i saw you standing on the sun the endless sand stretched the horizon and there was a strange ship on wheels next to you idea. You'd have to ask Brainiacs about that. I'm just a psychic. You know what, Drifter? Look for Brainiacs yourself. The fortune telling's over for today. I need to rest. Uh, no. The magic tower is closed for today. I'm very tired of you.
Oh no. It's <sighs> coffee. Uh, I suggest we chuck it overboard this instant. The Rangers will arrest us if they discover we have coffee on board. It's my sister Emma. Let's get closer. Haven't seen you for a while, Captain. Thank you for accepting my bro into your crew. Just imagine, there's an ancient locator complex just here, right underneath us. I found a useful thing for you there. A working battery! Here, take it. It'll come in handy. What else can I do for you, Captain? The smartest? I don't really know. Ask Dutchman. He's an engineer, after all. He should know. <sighs> Captain, it's a battery. An old one, for sure. But if we mount it on a boat, we'll be able to speed boost longer. must be the ladle archipelago. Oh, Captain, we need to look for pontoons. They're made of barrels.
sink soon. Hello, Captain. My name is Titus. I build boats and ships. Seven Foot is a trustworthy brand. What brought you here? You have a good barge. With proper care, it'll last a long time. I can offer you a Njord boat or a Sanya longboat. The boat is faster, but the longboat is more spacious. It's a deal, Captain, uh, but I don't need corks. As payment for my work, I need you to get me 100 kilos of explosives. How can I help you, Captain? There aren't many smart people around. The majority of the sector's population are either Harmlessly dim or frighteningly stupid. I think you might have noticed that yourself. Well, I guess I'm not a fool. Although I wouldn't really call myself smart. The seven-foot shipyard is at your service, Captain. Captain, I see the flying bubble. The ghosts probably know where to get explosives.
Hi, Sharp Eye Drifter. How can we help you? You know, Drifter, we don't divide people into smart and stupid. What really matters for us is whether they're good or bad. You can find explosives deep underwater, where there's old ammo on the ocean floor. Amo will probably be able to teach you. Oh, she's an expert in everything you find on the seabed. She's actually waiting for us in the Bobber Club right now, having some downtime after a long underwater raid. Join us, Drifter. The Bobber's not far at all. We are always glad to see you. Oh, it's so lonely up here sometimes. No one sees us, ghosts. Visit us more often, will you?
Hi, Captain. I'm Ricardo Diaz, the owner of the Bobber Club, the most chic establishment in our sector. Is it your first time here? The Bobber is the ideal place to relax. We've got a wide range of entertainment for wealthy captains. <laughs> We're always happy to welcome you and your corks. The Bobber's at your service, Captain. Your friends are waiting for you on the round couch. Here's our drifter at last. Ama was so happy to hear you'd be dropping by. Hi there, drifter. This is my favorite club. I always come here to relax after a long dive. How are you doing? Uh, hi, Captain. Uh, you wanted to ask Gamer about finding explosives. Hurry up and ask before she drinks all the tea in the club. Quit heaping slander on a poor little girl like me. I know my limits when it comes to tea. What do you want to know about explosives, Drifter? Easier to show you than explain. Especially when you're goggling at that dancer and are clearly in no state to learn. Go see Heatsink, the trader. It's not far from here. Buy a resource scanner and mount it on your boat. I'll finish my tea and catch up with you. How would you like to have fun, Captain? What pleasures do you seek here? I see your tastes are very singular, Captain. <laughs> There's a wide range of pretty and fun people at the Bobber. A lot of thrill seekers, some feisty ones. No smart ones, though, for sure. Flying keeps trying to finish your portrait. I'll be you are changing all the time, she says. The Bobber Club is at your service.
Hi, a stranger. I haven't seen you before. Kakawa trade posts will help you make some money. We sell special goods and the prices change all the time. Watch the prices at different trade posts. Buy cheap, sell expensive. You'll get rich. Kakawa trade posts are a political and open to all. Are you looking for something specific? Or do you... Aha, uh -huh. agreed. A scanner is a must. There'll be a hundred corks. Kagawa trade posts will help you make some money. We sell special goods, and the prices change all the time. Watch the prices at different trade posts. Buy cheap, sell expensive. We have all sorts of people among us. Mostly, they are prudent and enterprising, of course. I can't think of any smart ones. Captain, open the constructor, select... Captain, I see Ama's craft. She'll tell us where to look for explosives. Oh, there you are. Did you get the scanner? It's simple. Turn the boat toward the source of the signal. Focus on the semicircular line on the scanner sensor. Yeah, try it out. There's a shipwreck not far away. I'll be waiting for you there. I bet I'll get there before you.
Easy enough, as you can see. Here, have my old echo sounder. When it's installed, you'll see dots on the sounder screen. Run the dredge when you're right above one of them. Captain, open the menu.
We have enough explosives. We can go back for a new boat. You're on time. I've just finished working on your longboat. By the way, Dutchman and Flying were looking for you from a hot air balloon. It seems they have some kind of gift for you. They're waiting for you nearby. The seven-foot shipyard is at your service, Captain. Captain, don't forget to mount the weapons and other equipment on the deck of the new boat. Captain, I can see the balloon not far off.
near the balloon. Got a new boat, Captain. Congratulations! We have a little gift for you. Some paint. You'll be able to paint your new vessel. Problems? Not at all. Our friends come over with hydrogen and gifts. Sharkies are our friends. Sharkies are just like humans. They're wonderful friends, charming girls and heroic men among them. I see, you're a prisoner of stereotypes. When you're next in the bobber, we'll have a surprise for you. Yes, we're having a party there with Ama. She's still celebrating the end of her latest dive. We are always glad to see you. Oh, it's so lonely up here sometimes. No one sees us.
Captain, your friends are waiting at the same place. Here's our drifter. Dutchman says hi. He's busy fixing cylinders and sends his apologies. This place is really awesome. Like I said, it's my favorite club. I promised you a surprise, didn't I? Meet Shia. I remember you couldn't take your eyes off her last time. Pleased to meet you, Captain. Flying's told me so much about you. My name is Shia, and I'm from the Sharky tribe. A mutant pirate, as you call us. I bet you've only ever seen them through the crosshair of a machine gun. I'm not surprised. After all, Sharkies have been at war with humans for a very long time. I owe my popularity in the Bobber to the local rabble's taste for the exotic. They get a kick out of the mutant girl dancing for them. All right. Our legends say that the ancestors of the modern-day Sharkies came here in four nuclear submarines a very long time ago. The submarines were used to evacuate the families of certain high-ranking humans and soldiers. That's right. The ancestors of the Sharkies built a city on the four submarines. It was called Fang back then. They soon managed to start providing for themselves and making things. The legends call that time the Golden Era. Sometime later, the reactor of one of the submarines exploded, and it had to be sunk. The three that remained were used to urgently transport the city to another area of the sector. Many people died, but almost immediately, the city gained new residents. As the city of Feng was being hastily evacuated, another huge vessel sank in our sector, a cruise liner. It was also carrying rich ancient humans, but they were from another country. Our ancestors rescued the humans from the liner, found room for them on the submarines, and gave them water, food, and jobs. We hoped that together we'd be able to rebuild Fang, despite the devastating losses. But after a while, the people we'd saved waited until half of the Fang warriors left for a distant raid and attacked their saviors. They slaughtered most of the men and took over the city. Yo, Drifter! Aren't three chicks too many for just one guy? The sea gods say we should share. The mutant's coming with me. You can keep the rest. And don't get in my way, or it can get worse. You wanna do this the hard way? Gonna talk back to the scavengers? You are so screwed, Drifter. We'll sink your boat, wipe out your crew, and then take the mutants anyway. We'll wait for you behind the nearest jumper. Don't take too long. There's a two-way jumper east of here. Are you dumb? A regular jumper? A translocator, damn it! The teleporter is somewhere nearby.
Wow, it's a two-way teleporter. 